Spirit of Jesus, we are flying in this second night. Glory be to God in the highest. We are welcome all over the world to the second night of this year's 40 days apostolic prayer retreat. Don't forget, people of God, that the theme for this year's edition is help from above. If you are there now, please do the work of an evangelist. Pick your phone, put a call to somebody, your friends, your family, your colleagues that we are already in the second night. Reaching you from Nigeria here, courtesy, Love of Christ Chapel International. Before we do anything this wonderful day, we enter his presence with praise and it was caught with thanksgiving, with a heart of adoration. Let's welcome the minister of God that God is going to use for this session. Hallelujah. Amen. Thank you, Jesus. Praise God. Hallelujah. We begin to lift up our hands and begin to bless the name of Jesus wherever we are. Begin to declare and say, God, you are mighty. We declare that you are wholesome. Thank you, Jesus. Yes, you are the Lord. Most high, yes, you are the Lord over every situation. Most yes, you are the Lord. Yes, you are the Lord. We worship most high. Yes, you are the Lord. Yes, you are the Lord. God, I will bless your name. Most high. Most high. Hallelujah. Amen. Wherever you are, the Bible says, for God and I be the princes of his people. You are good. You are good. You are good. Jesus. Every day. Every hour. You are good. Everybody say, you are good, you are good, you are good, you are good, you are good. You are good. You are good. Jesus. Every, day. every day, every hour, every hour, you pray, you are good, 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 you you are good, you are Everybody say, you are good, Lord, oh, hey, Jesus, every day, every hour, you are good, Jesus, every day, every hour, 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 you are good, all around me, Jesus, every day, every hour, you are good, Lord. We lift our hands to give you the glory. Everybody say, we will praise you. We will praise you for the rest of our day. We will praise you for the rest of our day. We clap our hands. We clap our hands. Oh, 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 Yes, we will praise you. Say Jesus, oh, Emmanuel, Heavenly Father. We will praise you for the rest of our days. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. It's a good God. There is no shadow of turning of variableness in him. That's why we are depending on him for our help, because he's a good God. You are welcome once again. If you just joined, this is a moment of mercy. Reaching you from Nigeria here, God see Love of Christ Chapel International. The second day of our yearly 40 days prophetic 
prayer retreat. And theme for this year's edition is help from above. We go to the next segment now, which is exhortation and confession from our book. Hallelujah. Amen. Thank you, Jesus. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. You are welcome, beloved, to greet you from our first day of the prayer meeting. Today, by the grace of God, don't forget we are looking at help from above as a central thing. And for day two, we are looking at Jesus' help personified. The Bible tells us this in 2 Timothy 1 9. It says, Who saved us and called us to a holy calling, not because of our works, but because of his own purpose and grace, which he gave us in Christ Jesus before the ages began. I know you have seen some people and you look at their life and say, This is grace. They can only be able to do this, to achieve this, because they have the grace to do so. Have you ever wondered what is behind that statement? That's grace we are talking about. It's a person in the person of Jesus Christ. It is Jesus Christ in the person of this person that is helping him or her to achieve that thing that you that you are looking at and you are appreciating. Apostle Paul told us this in 1 Corinthians 15 10. He said, I am what I am by the grace of God. The grace that will be told of upon me is not in vain. Even though I labor, even though he said, even though he labor in all that he did. It was still the grace of God that was working in him that was able to help him achieve all he achieved. What I want to say, what I want to um, express is that if you have Christ, you will be able to do things effortlessly. Because grace is defined is the ability to do things effortlessly. You see, some people, what you are striving to do, what you are struggling to do, they do it effortlessly. Of course, there, there's something called ability. There's something called ability, but there's also grace. With ability, you still struggle at a point. You struggle. But with grace, you don't struggle. You don't struggle to go. When Christ is in the boat of your life, you will be able to accomplish things effortlessly. You see, our Father and the Lord have gathered all of us together. You see the way he that, and everyone is appreciating the grace of God upon his life. That is what we are talking about. When you have grace, people will be magnet. You will magnetize people to yourself. That's it. What grace does, and you can only be able to get this one when you have Christ. If you don't have Christ, you will only labor in Him, you will only struggle in Him. You need Christ, just as you all need Christ. You see, the main reason, if we are to summarize the whole the life of Christ, everything is that He has come to help man. Christ has come to help you, He has come to help me. Don't let his coming into this world be in vain. If you do not connect to this hell, if you do not go to him, if you do not come to him, his coming into the world in this in your life will be in vain. Please don't let that be. It is as many that has received, that has received Christ. It is these people that have the right to be called children of God. And if you are a child of God, you will be able to receive whatever it is that your life has need of to succeed. Everything is in God. Come to Christ. Everything is in Him. In the spirit, I say the fifth is ready. He's waiting for you. He wants to help you. You need to surrender your life to Him. You need to surrender your life to Him. In this year's 40 days, Apostolic Prayer, Apostolic Prayer Retreat, the Holy Spirit is telling you that He wants to help you. But you need to come. You need to come and tell Him that you have need of His help. He wants to help you. Please, you come. The feast is ready. Surrender all to him. He will give you the needed grace to accomplish everything that you desire in your life. And it will be well with you in Jesus' name. Amen. It will be well with you, every one of us in the name of Jesus. Amen. Amen. Let's move on to our confession. Our confession is our possession. I am an heir of salvation. I am an heir of salvation. I boast in my relationship. I boast in my relationship. I am a seed of Abraham. I am a seed of Abraham. I am a child of God. I am a child of God. There is no condemnation. There is no condemnation for me. For me. Because I have been justified. Jesus has taken my place. He paid the price for sin. That I did not owe. He took the punishment. He took the punishment. I cannot bear. I cannot bear. Now I am born again. Now I am born again. I was weak. I was weak. Now I am strong. Now I am strong. I was condemned. Now I'm justified. Now I'm justified. I wanted to 
I was appointed to route. Now I am the apple of God's eye. I can do all things through Christ who strengthens me. Heaven is not close to me. I know Jesus. Jesus is the light of the world. I belong to Jesus. I have victory over darkness. Help is available for me. Jesus helped me to fulfill my ministry. Jesus has helped me to identify my purpose. Jesus is my dependable help. Jesus is my dependable help. Jesus is my available help. Jesus is my never exhausted help. Jesus is my sure help. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. What a wonderful segment. By the grace of Jesus, people of God, let me tell us that if you are in America, to be precise, this book is in America now. The hard, the hard copy is in America now by the grace of God. But please, just call this number to get your copy. If you are in America, just call this number to get your copy by the grace of God. Plus one. 917-623-0704 plus 1-917-623-0704 Bible says, Dear Mary, let them oh. sing hymns, let them sing psalms. Oh. And that's the next segment we go now. We go to our hymn, by the grace of God Almighty. Let's welcome the minister of God for this. Hallelujah. Praise God. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. I implore us to open our manual to page 389 as we take the in standing on the promises of God. Hallelujah. Thank you, Jesus. Standing on the promises of Christ, thy King. Standing on the promises of Christ.
standing on the promises of Christ. The Lord, to win, bound 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 to A God who never fails. I have a God who never fails. Hallelujah. I have a God say, who never fails. Thank you, Jesus. We are standing on his promises that say that will be your present help in time of trouble. This is the segment that by the spirit of Jesus that we have been waiting for. The life of his presence is here now. The mercy seat as he had died in our midst since yesterday. About three days ago now, because we're already in the third morning, but second night, that the program kickstart. The life of his presence is here. The joy of the Almighty, which is our strength, is in the house with us this morning. With Jesus' joy in my heart, I join the word to bring on board my Father and the Lord. It's a voice in our generation. By the mercies of God, it's an apostle of mercy, called and anointed for the liberation of mankind. As it comes to declare the counsel of God over our lives this second night. There is joy in my spirit already. I don't know why, but I know God knows why. Please join me as I bring about my father, the Prophet Peter Denny Oloko. Good a good day, sir. We'll celebrate Jesus. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. We'll celebrate Jesus. Hallelujah. Hallelujah. Somebody shout hallelujah. Hallelujah. My father, my father. My father, my father. Let's hear you, my father, my father. My father, my father. I celebrate you. I celebrate you. Because there is no like unto you. Because there is no like unto you. Great is my God. Great is my God. And greatly to be praised. And greatly to be praised. I celebrate you, Jesus. I celebrate you, Jesus. I celebrate you, my Savior. I celebrate you, my Savior. I celebrate you, my deliverer. I celebrate you, my deliverer. My strength, my strength, my king, my king, my Lord, my Lord. I worship you. I worship you. Thank you, Jesus. Thank you, Jesus. I pray for somebody. I receive it. Before this tonight's encounter is over, you will carry a new story. Hey! Hey! That your environment that is manipulative. That forces in that environment, bearing every good thing around you, that power in your environment, let the fire of God naked. Look at the scripture as I bring the man of God tonight. Second King chapter 6 verse 27, and he said, if the Lord do not help you, we are shall lie. <laughs> if God, if the Lord, that is the whole king of the land of yes, sir. If God will not help you, where will shall I help you? Mm. When shall I help you? Is he out of the bar floor or out of the wine press? Sir, life comes with different challenges. Mm. Challenges of all sorts. Mm. And there's no immunity for them. There's mm. no immunity. Uh, mm. 
<laughs> Except the arrival of help from the king of kings. See, listen to me. Tonight is too loaded. Still connect somebody. See, so, see, tonight, I'm going to be praying specifically for some people. <laughs> and uh, yesterday, it was uh, something else. It was unusual. Mm. Uh, Holy Spirit night. Holy Ghost night. And uh, Holy Ghost night be that one. Yes. Out rivers. of your belly shall flow rivers. You are not a well. You are a river. So tonight is the second night. And uh, we have Dr. Yinko Sholali in the house. So something is about to happen. A word is coming. A light is coming. A revelation is coming. And the Lord is dealing with your issue. Amen. You are coming out free. Amen. Dr. Sholali. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. 2021 message. Thank God. Air from above. Yes, sir. I appreciate it, sir. The Lord is your strength, sir. Last year, they have not recovered. That one. Yes, sir. This year is going to be great, sir. This one is. is we are going to be breaking it. It's concept just... by concept. Uh, we are going to be breaking it down. And the understanding that we back it up, we deliver express, express freedom. Mm. In the way they have never seen before. Amen. In the amen. mighty name of Jesus. Amen. Uh, that As we are talking will... now, the whole London is yes, watching. Yes. All over the world, US, UK, Jamaica, Europe, Africa, uh, where including you Saudi. Have. Saudi Arabia, Iraq, Iran. A <laughs> woman from Saudi Arabia <laughs> paid for Boma Shore. Wow. Wow. The Lord is said to do mighty things. Might, massive. Mighty things. Yes. Let me first of all start by saying this word of prayer to all viewers all over the world. Mm. That any satanic arrangement to deflate you, mm. ah. any satanic arrangement to deflate you, if you can shout a louder amen today, they will scatter by fire. Yeah. 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 Daddy, I want to start mm. by saying this. Wazuza. That the shortest way to exist as a tragedy on earth is to lack air. Yes. It's the shortest. It's way. the shortest way to exist as a tragedy. You are a tragedy when you lack air. Huh. The only way for a man to exist as an apology, when they look at a man, they go, no, 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 this is an, an apology. It's an apology. That mm. means it's a man despised by all. Mm. It's a man rejected by all. Mm. It's a man that when they see him, grief's eyes. It's a man when they see him, they avoid. Mm. It's a man that even when he sees his colleagues, he will dodge. Mm. That is when a life has lack air. Mm. Yes, sir. The best is not blessed if you are not heard. Ah. Mm. Even the best. Even the best, if you are not helped. Mm. Because the only way to be powerless is to be helpless. Mm, that's right. The only way to be hopeless is to be helpless. Mm. The only way to be careless is to be helpless. Mm. The only way to be reckless is to be helpless. Mm. The only way to be lifeless is to be helpless. Wow. The only way to be wretched is to be helpless. Huh. Those who are helpless are actually less. They are less. They are less. Yeah. They are less. Less human. They are less human. Mm -hmm. As we talk about inferiority complex, when a man lacks air, he does not suffer only from inferiority complex. He himself is inferior. Mm -hmm. Wow. He is inferior. Azusa. Because when air is not in place, destiny is displaced. Ah. Mm. It takes a dimension of air for life to be fulfilled. Mm. The cheapest way to be held is to lack air. Mm. When assistance is not in place, resistance is cheap. Yes, sir. Mm. If you lack air, you will beg. Ah. If you lack air, you will beg. Mm. If you lack air in life, you will suffer. Ah. If you lack air, you will be set back. Mm. If you lack air, you will be demoted, you will be deflated, you will decrease, you will reduce. Mm. If you lack help, they will mesmerize you. Wow. If you lack help, disqualify yourself among the candidates that are entitled to reach out. Oh. You mm. can die with all the gifts if you lack help. Oh. Mm. You can die with your skill if you lack help. With all the skill. If you lack help, you can't have voice. Mm. If you lack help, you will lack face. Mm. You talk, they say, where are you? Who are you? Where are you coming from? Oh, well, well, uh, yeah. Because it's not only about what you know, it's about who you know. Yes, mm. You can know so many things, but those who are reigning, they know who to know. Mm. 
Amen. They know who to know. Certificate is useless in the school of hell. Because every human lifting is an abomination to God. Only those who enjoy the favor of God are actually qualified for his divine help. Mm. Help is not cheap. It's not cheap. It's not cheap. It's not cheap. Help is actually spiritual. Help grows from the mercy of God. That's Only right. those that God has shown mercy will receive help from men. Yes, mm. They can have it in abundance, but they will look aside from your space. Look at the case of Samaritan man. Mm. A sinner was met, they beat him, they disqualified him, they dealt with him. High priest went, he did not help him. That's right. Levi helped, they did not help him. They are, and they, are and they, they, were, they, they were even mandated to help. That's serious. Joseph had a dream. Joseph had a vision. Where did he end? If the hey, butler did not prison. come, he will die inside that prison. Yes, sir. Prison. Yes, sir. With help, we go where? Go where? Help is a divine design. Help is a mm. deliberate design. Yes, help is technically, spiritually designed by God so that no mortal man will be proud in his presence. Yes, uh, the road to progress is through help. Mm. The road to success is through help. Mm. The road to lifting is through help. Mm. The road to expansion is through help. Mm. You are limited as a man in all ways. Oh God of fierce, let's just see Last year we run this program on two radio stations. Yes, sir. Mm. When the help came. Yes, sir. This year on ten different in ten Hallelujah. states. I, I like this testimony. Hallelujah. Almost saying that testimony. It will be alone say amplify towards the prophet. Yes, sir. From two uh, states. Ten. See, now, see, 10 see, different see, see seven television yeah. stations. Seven see, television, seven television, television stations, stations in London. Wow. Even in UK. You know, I was saying that help is a voice of amplification. Mm. It's a voice of amplification. Error, I saw dear. Hold it, babe. Because when you are not yet a reference, you are, you are not there. And one of our listeners is now there. there. I said we are in Oyo <laughs> State already. She said no. She said no. <laughs> I want in my town. Go more show. Go more show. Go more show. People will be begging to assist you when God steps in. Yes, sir. They will be begging. Yes, sir. You will be saying, you need it. Ah, my putting your brother in law. Ah, I must help you. When they say, you know what? They say, but they have done this, they have done that. They just came and said to me, ah, I'm describing somebody under the sound of my voice. You have come to the level. Now I hear, Paro Sateba, the entire world will submit to you. What you mean that you lack that is in the hand of men after this meeting, it will be cheap in your hand. Hey! King Asherus would have died like, like a sesame flower yes, if, wow. if Mordecai was not around to reveal the, 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 the coup. So you cannot see, you cannot that see. That is a man at the top are, of you his... Because you talk to him about day, the moment you say no to help, you are dead. You are no longer there. Mm. You are dead. Because the maximum height you are going to achieve in life is as a result of the quality of help you have received. Yes, sir, let me differentiate help from above from help from men so that we know where we are going and the condition they want. Now, look at this case, sir. The Bible says Jesus sent somebody to go and untie the coat. Yeah, that was tough. Uh, he said, go and untie the coat. He said, but when you get there, they will ask you, who sent you? Uh -huh. mm. Now, go and on time means I'm sending helpers to liberate somebody that had been tied for 20 years. That's right. But the moment they got there, they asked them, who asked you? Who sent Be, you? Who sent you? They will query, they will question, they will check. But if God steps in, when a man is set to deliver or to help you, Another man can query them. They will ask, is it from your town? They will ask, is it from is it the same mother, the same father? <laughs> so why are you carrying you know, this matter on your head. But when God steps in, when eggs come from above, they can't check that egg. They cannot stop that. Immediately egg. he said the, the moment Lord he said the Lord that that, that said they, they will they they cannot query God. They cannot. They cannot stop God. That is one, that is the first case. Now, look at another case here when the scripture is talking about when men are coming in. There are limitations when you talk about men. In John chapter 5, the yes, Bible says one, condition number one, when God, why and when God must show up. When people have come to a point whereby they have abandoned you. You are abandoned. Yes. They got to a point where they said, this 
Even human beings cannot help him. Mm. Hopeless case, impotent case, helpless case, wretched case. Mm. They said this case is, is there is nothing that can come out. It's an hopeless case. And so there are issues in life. Doctors will agree only God can do it. Even the doctors. The, even the doctors. There are issues that can confuse me. I want you to I want you to tell me one can of a little. I think one woman, you want it to look at my Chama Penya, two by Montio, she could say, I want to say, I eat it, you want to buy. I eat it, you want to buy it by Kuluju. Right from the mother's room, Kuluju, and they said to Jesus, Talu de Shegan, who said, This is a case. And Jesus did not doubt it too. He said, It's a case. He said, It's a case. But nobody said. They looked at another case. They said, Ah, this is another case. We couldn't cast this one out. He said, It's a case. And this kind of case cannot come except through fasting and prayer. Sir, cases exist in life that the owner himself cannot even understand. Mm. The owner himself cannot even discover it. You will be even asking somebody what is wrong. He will tell you, I don't even know what is wrong. I cannot even describe what is wrong. Men mm. are carrying problems that men cannot treat. Mm. They can only solve problems you tell them. You can imagine a king said, I, I dreamt. But if you cannot tell me the meaning of my dream, you are not ready to help me. They said, ah, ah, it's not possible. Tell us the dream. We will tell, tell you the interpretation, interpretation of that. Ah, oh, you want to take an advantage I of me? I did not even remember oh, my oh, dream. Oh, no, no, now, it was a yes, case again, and that is what is happening to humanity. They want people to see and to tell them what they are going through, and they are going through things. Kings are going through things. The rich are going through things. The mm. old are going through things. Children are going through things. A lot of things are happening that actually call for help. Yes, sir. But at a point. When men can, and even if it's his wife, he will just say, Lord, we pray that our husband will die. Mm -hmm. <laughs> but it's true. Yeah, we'll do. This is the case of this man. They have tried their best, and they said, We have brought you to a point whereby we have left you alone. What is your way? That is the condition number one when God must show up. When men have abandoned you. When you are abandoned. God must show up. That is why I'm saying, I perceive in my heart, globally, there are people here, particularly in UK, they are stranded. In UK. They are stranded. In US, they are stranded. All over the world, discrimination. People cannot even describe what they are going through. People don't even have the English, the language to describe the challenges they are passing through. And this is the why, reason why Eba this program... Nakata. Anywhere and everywhere you are, they have abandoned Osman. you. Husband, man, children, they have abandoned you. They have said goodbye to you. Only one amen, the Lord will visit you. Amen! To be singled out in life is beyond human effort. Yes. Mm. For somebody to be lifted, for somebody to be brought out, for somebody to be brought out for distinction, it, it goes beyond human effort. Mm. There are heights in life that belongs to God. Yes, sir. Mm. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. There are heights in life that go. men will say, no, 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 no. This, this is, is the finger, this of, is God. finger of God. Oh, this is the finger of God. There are situations in life and of life when David will confront a Goliath not as a soldier, but as a shepherd. Mm -hmm. He will confront Goliath not as a man, but as a boy. Mm -hmm. He will confront a Goliath not for the war he prepared for, boy, for emergency war. Oh. He will confront a Goliath without using the battles of Amos of, 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 of human being, but only ordinary snake. Then you will know that behind every stone that struck the forehead of Goliath was grace and help. Yes, sir. Mm. There are heights in life that it is not age that will place you there. That's right. Uh -uh. There are heights in life beyond money. Mm. There are many men who decide to be the president of this nation. Mm. They have the money, they have everything, but they, they, they didn't get there. Mm. <laughs> Even something, they died, they did not get there. And those you, you will be thinking they will not get their idea. <laughs> there are heights in life. That is why I'm saying to be singled out in life goes beyond human effort. Yes, See, if you can describe where you are, that it is my strength, yes, then sir. it's no longer gone. Wow, wow. And when people and God will be telling you that is my sovereignty. Mm -hmm. Second Chronicles 26, he said, Uzzah became great. His name spread, and he was mighty because, because he was, was marvelous. Yeah. 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 And when people come bela yeto jayupe, there is what we call marvelous help, yeah. not single help, not gentle help. He was marvelously help.
I am describing somebody today. I don't care where you are. Decrees of nations against you, policies of nations against you, friends and families against you. They've sent you out. No money. You are rejected. You are abandoned. As I am saying it as I'm hearing him, God will single you out. Amen. I love when Hannah was composing it. He said, he said, speak not arrogantly against God. Mm. He said, let no man speak arrogantly against God. He said, for what? He said, for those who stumbled were guarded with strength. Yes, only, only those who stumbled, only they were harmed with strength. I love that in mind. Only they were harmed to teeth with strength, yet they stumbled. Only those who gave back became feeble. Only why? Only because by strength shall no man prevail. Only us can be prepared for battle. Victory belongs unto God. The Bible says it's a vain thing for a man to think that it is by his soul that he will deliver his strength. The Bible says, for Israel did not enter into that land or possess that by land their by their soul. Yes, there is a dimension of him that secures future. Yes, sir. Mm -hmm. There is a dimension. That is what I'm saying. This conference, the testimony that will come out of it will bring out tears. Amen. Yeah. It will bring, many people will be shedding tears Amen. because it is the voice of the Lord yes, going forth all over the world. Come. You see, COVID has affected people. Mm. Government has affected people. Mm. War has affected Policies. people. Talk about Israel. Talk about America. Talk about people being cheated. Whether by tribe, whether by color, whether people are grieving, people are crying, people are displeased, people are depressed. Go and check the rate of suicide. People are denied access, no money to go to school, no money to eat. There's inflation everywhere. So there is a need for this war. I will help you. As ah, I ah, oh no, wow. ah. Verse 10. I will help you. Mm. I will uphold you with my hand of righteousness. That's Fear right, not. Right. Do not be dismayed. I will strengthen you. Mm. Yes, I will help you. Mm. There's a dimension of God in the affairs of men that command stability. Mm. There's a dimension of uh, in the man of men. Sir, there was a girl, he, he, he went to, she went to a South Cape poly. She went in to read one useless cause anyhow. <laughs> that was why the lecturer said, she must, he must sleep with the, with the girl if that girl will, will graduate. Mm. And the girl said, no, I'm not going to sleep with you. He said, let us see who will help you. Ah. Because the cause is a cause. He said, I will determine the length of your years in this school. He said, I, he said, when I fail you, I will fail you, I will fail you, and I will frustrate you. And, and, and the lady did not know where to go because she had wanted from caucus. Did not know what to do. And, and he helped. He said, Lord, help me. That was only man. Lord, help me. Because anybody only, Lord, help me. She took jam that year. When she was about to go to part two, they actually failed her. But that jam, she passed for pharmacy. Wow. <laughs> There is a dimension of God in the affairs of mankind that secures a place for you. And that's, that height is not by height. It's by help. It's by help. It's by help. So there are times God will deliberately step people down so that you can come in. Second thing I want people to know is that there is a place you have that you cannot fulfill destiny. Mm. Except help will bring you out. Lord, be Lord, you can't be among the sick and talk about the message of healing. You can't be poor and still talk about prosperity to people. Can't you be can't barren. be rich. You can't be barren and still say, oh, oh. No, God will have to bring you out of and what are frustrated. And it's help that will bring you out. When Jonah was right inside the belly of the fish, how will he preach that message to Nineveh? God must help him and bring him out. He yes. said, right from the belly of the fish, I cried out unto the Lord, and the Lord brought me out. Yes. You can't fulfill destiny if the location you are is not jamming to where God is, uh, is helping you out. Yes, if David had been in the wilderness, where and how will he wear the crown? Yes. You can't be in prison as Joseph and yet fulfill the destiny of all stars and moon bowing down. So there is a dimension of F that must relocate you. Mm. There is a dimension of F. So some people where they are, that is where the issue is. So that when we say, God, help me, God, help me, he will reach out to you. He will bring you out of holes. He will bring you out of crevices. He will bring you out of obscurity. Mm. He will now bring you to limelight. That's why. Right. That's why I prophesy to somebody. Hallelujah. Yes. Where you are, that you are not hard. Mm. If you don't watch, are you born? Uh, 
Ibi to wa ti ori oru lan rowo. Ibi to wa tan ti gbagbe e. Ibi to wa tin wo celebrate e. They only tolerate you. After this message, mercy will bring you out. Hey! Yes, Lord. After this message, help we bring you out. Yes, sir. After this message, help we bring you yes, out. Sir. That is the nature of men too. Hmm. They will keep you where people cannot see you. Hmm. If they didn't help Meshibu said by saying, ah, do the body low out. That guy was not ready to reveal where that the, the man was. Because he knew the consequence. Oh, feel it. Oh, no, uh, uh, yeah, can you know? <laughs> he, see how Boshe, Boshe polarized here. He, he was telling the guy, he didn't come in. And that was an absolute lie. So that is human being. That is why I'm differentiating help from God and help from men. Even when Jesus, Jesus was setting this man free, here what those people said. They say it's not lawful for you to raise your head. Come by any sort of but why did you carry your head? It's not lawful to for you to carry your head. That is human being. So when the man was saying, I have no man, he really actually had no man. He really had, he said, I have no man. He really actually had no man. Because this is a situation whereby even when Jesus healed him, they said, No, no, today is not they the should day. have been celebrating. Don't you come for? Come on, for thank God. 38, 38 years, years. 38 years. 38 years. See human being. See where your help must your help must come from above. He, he, they said, he said, no. He, they said, why did you carry your bed today? He said, he who said I should carry my bed. He said, no, you shouldn't have been today. He said, okay, how many years? How many 38 years? Do one Sabbath? How many 38 years? Don't you know Sabbath? So if you take one Sabbath in one week, that is 365 Sabbaths in a year, multiply it by 38. That is over 2,000 Sabbaths in Notilo in 38 years. He did not choose one to stand up. He had chosen all to suffer. If he had chosen one Sabbath to rise, why will they not forgive him? Are you a daddy genius? Are you a celebrating? This is somebody that you should even forget the day and the date and be celebrating. They say, why must you rise up? That is why I'm saying that when it comes to human being, that is their dimension. He said, I have no man. And that is true. That is true, no man. Ah. No man. Mokpala Sheleni, if you can scream that amen from the depth of your heart, everybody standing against your lifting, every human opinion standing against your lifting, with one amen, they are dead. Hey! They searched out a law that was against him. <laughs> they supported their point with a law. That is human being. They already have already made reasons. They will not think about it. Why things should not be okay for you? Why you should not go ahead? Mm. So, actually, no man. And by the way, if you look at it, he said, while I am going, someone will come and they will overtake me. Mm. Because that is men. They believe in competition. Mm. I should go in first. I should go in first. It's a selfish end. Now, somebody who stepped in and was ill, ideally should be merciful and compassionate enough to wait behind him. <laughs> Am I moving? Well, we can't hear for the cat, and can't hear vote. We can't hear your money. I am Boba and I want to do a jet your money. A jacket meeting, a bay, she be meeting. She build you to meet it. Let me help this man. Waiting for one day to help this man will not cost you anything. But the moment they are through, and now the lost sunny town because I didn't know you had spent 38 years. How did they know? So, you know, human being, they could spread the bad news that they have spent 38 years, but they could not wait enough to even carry him <laughs> and throw him there. I'm even saying those who had received healing, that is human being for you. They, because if it's going to be and when help has some assaulted, destiny will crawl. Mm. Mm. When there is no help, man will crawl. Man, because oh mama da fa unekan, oh mama da be. And you can't go far if it is you. You cannot go far if it is you. There is a dimension of help from even higher source to give you a voice. Mm. And you know, I don't know how you go. Do I go on to call your phone 29, 15, 15, 5 pounds, 10 pounds, 20 pounds? Oh, they think, oh, they think, gosh. But when God is about to do something, He will send a man like Ashros, who will say, Somebody accepted me and I want to reward him. 
The reward of Pharaoh is different from the reward of Potiphar. Mm. Mm. It's That's different. Right. Potiphar my fear same one. Pharaoh my grace only thing. Yeah. The reward of this one is different. He said, he said, somebody is here. He has helped me. I want to help him. I want to show me. I want to thank him. Okay. Uh, he said, um, uh, well, then, well, then, can you suggest? The enemy was suggesting promotion for his own enemy. He said to himself, I am the one. <laughs> and, and God was so smart. God was so smart. The man described the event without mentioning any name. <laughs> he did not say Mordecai. This is a do. man that is even <laughs> almost the head of all the, all the cabinet. He was even too. advanced and promoted forward to be the chiefest among the princes. Yeah. And that and was the first assignment. And he's still thinking he that another that one will finish, be yeah, for him. He said he will finish that guy. He said, let the king, let him bring out the best cloth on the best horse, the one he has never won before. Somebody I'm describing your enemies will suggest a promotion. Yeah. 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 He said, let them, let the chiefest prince, let go before him and begin to announce, this is the one that God loves it. This is the one that king loves it. The man, and the king said, rise now and do it to Medecai. He said, what? He said, what, Mordecai? Mordecai? <laughs> His friend said, if you are falling before him once, you will never rise before him. He said, that guy is a strange man, a great man who later became a state man. Wow. This is, own, I said there is a seat reserved for God. Mm. That elderly people will submit to you. Mm. They will call you father. Mm. And they will be saying, oh, Lord, I'm a father. Mm. We know we are older. Mm. We know we are richer. Mm. We know we are bigger. Mm. Are bigger. So even when they want to give you gifts, is their own personal gifts they want to give you, they will still kneel down. Mm. That is a level mm. when help is speaking. Mm. That is a level when help is in place. Mm. So that is why I'm saying, when you have found out that in life, you have spent a long time in a particular position, hmm. then you need help. Wow. You need help. Wow. When you have found out that you have to compete for one source, one source, there's only one person that will be lifted, there's only one river, there's only one angel, and there's only yes. one person. So when you find out that your miracle is, is a subject of competition, we have to compete for it, you need help. We are going to examine two. Mm. Because there are many keys we'll be examining in the course okay, of this. So that's right. But let's select two that are relevant to this one for today. The first one, ask for help. Mm. Must be asked for. Yes, cry for help. I love it the way Peter said it. He was sinking. Boisterous wind, he had boisterous wind, and he was sinking. Mm. The Bible says he cried out, mm. Master, Master, this is his save me. See, I like that. <laughs> <laughs> it's a good picture. In fact, this guy really, really sank. <laughs> hey, <he has> <laughs> this is this yes, the child Peter. He was yes, down. Yes, and he said, Master, the mysterious thing is this. He stretched forth his hand. Yes, sir. He didn't move this hands. Mm. Ah. Mm. He did not take a step. Mm. <laughs> Yes, sir. The guy had not taken so much step. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Mm. Okay. Mm. He had not taken so much step. Not they just too. said he saw Jesus afar off. Yes, sir. And yes, they sir. said, Spirit, you have seen spirit. You have seen spirit. He said, No, I'm not spirit. I'm Jesus. He said, If you have, tell me to come. Me to come. He said, Okay, you can come. He has not taken four steps. He yes, looked sir. at the wheel. He looked at the wheel. He said, Ah, Uriomini, Yamanini, Kilo de Mumani, Uriomini. And fear came in and he began to sink. And he looked. He said, Master, Master. Please help me. <laughs> and you know what he did? He stretched for this hand. Kai! Let's be Oh, boy. Wow, he stretched for this hand. And he pulled it. He did not only so pull it. So we did not even know the distance. Wow. Yes, sir. On the belt. He stretched for this hand. Kosari Loba. Kilo Veli Lili White. White Jove Mosari. Kosari Loba. Kosro Loba. Kode Nikomari. <laughs> Until he said, save me, save me. So each time you do not cry for help, it's a reflection of pride. Mm. Ah, a reflection it's a reflection of pride. Of pride. That you can deliver and yourself. Then, no, that I will, I will sort it out. Ah! Thank you. You will sort it out. <laughs> do you know, some people use suicide to say, let me end it. They sort it out with suicide. Then, 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 I should be going to kill myself. Let me help myself. And I will help myself. You can't see for eternities when you know it's only God that can sort things out. Mm. It's, it's, it's one, one level of arrogance. Mm. Because there are certain issues that God knows about. Yes. Mm. 
Like he shot the uh, room of. Uh, they are deliberate issue because he wants you, he wants you to know him. Of he wants you to acknowledge. Him. Yes, he wants you to call him. He wants you to cry out unto him. And the Lord shot him. Yes, sir. So if you now say I'm not going to ask for help, I'm not going to cry for help, I'm not going to call for help, you will be you will stay so long on that spot. Mm. Because all what God is expecting from you is to submit, is to humble yourself, is to ask the Lord, Father, I need you. Father, I need Lord, your help. Shout Father, show me your help. So in life, you must at every point in time, at any point in time, ask for help. Ask for it must be demanded. God, yes, particularly God, you must ask for help. Second thing that I noticed here, but we would begin to deal with others. He, he said, mm. he, he said unto him, he said, something brought you to this level. Stop it. Mm. There are certain things that we are doing, opening doors for arrow, opening doors for attack. He said, mm. if you do not stop sin, worse things will happen. Mm. Worse things will still happen. Somebody who spent 38 years, and you are still saying, <laughs> the worst in thing Tori if you do not stop. There are certain things you are doing that you need to stop so that you will not find yourself in a condition whereby you will be at the mercy of human beings. If not, you will just be looking for men all throughout life. But if you don't want to be looking for men, hey, I need man, I need man, I need man, I beg man, I beg man, then you need to beg God. If you don't want to be crying unto men, crying unto men, you need to cry unto God. Then whatever it is that you identify, that is responsible for the situation and the position you have, stop it. Mm. That you will not be a, 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 an object of ridicule any longer. Mm. I have a few prayer points that I want to just I want Katamana. to pray. And as we pray it, I am I believe that the Lord is going to answer. You are Amen. going to open your mouth and you are going to say, My father, my father. My, my father, father, my father. Let it be a bit louder. My, my father, my father. This week. This week. Let destiny air pass locate me. Let destiny air pass locate me. Open your mouth and ask the Lord. The Father in the mighty name of Jesus. I pray and I thank you, Father. In Jesus' mighty name, we have prayed. Amen. I want you to shout, my father, my father. My father, my father. New doors of favor. New doors of favor. New doors of favor. Open now. Open, now. open your mouth and ask the Lord that doors of favor will open unto you. In Jesus' mighty name, we are praying. Amen. One more prayer. You are going to ask the Lord, my father, my father. Let your mercy bring me out. Let your mercy sing me out. Let your mercy bring me out. Let your mercy showcase me. Let your mercy introduce me. Let your mercy announce me. Let your mercy promote me. Let your mercy deliver me. Let your mercy raise me. Let your mercy Open your mouth and pray. Ah. Thank you, Father. In Jesus' mighty name, we are praying. Amen. Any giant that is denying you access to your rest. Fire. After this meeting, they are dead. Amen. Any platform promoting mockery in your life. Fire. After this meeting, they are dead. Amen. Thank you, Father. Thank you. In Jesus' mighty name, we have prayed. Amen. Listen to me. Jesus. This year, with this subject, ah, your issue with yourself. Now, they said that deceiver said he will rise, even after he has died. They said, three things you must do. That chapter 27. They said, one, roll this, a massive stone, roll it against him. Number two, put a seal, Roman seal. And number three, set a wash. When that theory is in place. So on the day of resurrection, chapter 28, help came from above. Even for our Lord Jesus. Call it, but one, go and make sure he does not rise. But they go and make sure. Till the time they mention that statement, go and make sure it does not rise. 
So help man came from a bow for Jesus. An angel came from a bow, yes. rolled away the soul, sat on it, and all the monitoring spirit and they became like a dead man. Sir, I pray for you. If I hear me like thunder, every strange monitoring spirit that is monitoring your case, they die. Every strange stone rock, they, they roll over you that they will not rise. The Lord roll it away. Pray that to the prayer. By the grace of God, with Psalm 31. Pray that to the prayer. Every monitoring spirit pro program around me to block help. Be, be wasted. Be rooted out. Root them out. Your man. Monitoring spirit program around me. Number two, every strange stone that is rolled against me. Road, stone of delay to block my destiny. Let it be rolled away. Number three, every strange mark in my body that is making effort to run away from me be washed away by the blood. Pray that to the prayer. I pray as you pray that prayer, you will see unusual results. Ah, before I meet you later tonight for the third night, you are coming with testimony. Amen. Embargo is released. Amen. Embargo is removed. Amen. Embargo is removed. Amen. Barriers are broken. Amen. It is settled. Amen. I decree today you will be the first to have a major testimony. Amen. Go and get this your book. It's too massive. Special cases are treated there. Those who are single that need to be married, what kind of prayer they should pray is there. Serious issues. Debt. Cancellation. What kind of prayers? Those who want to travel. What kind of prayer? Those who are believing God for their for their document. What kind of prayers? It's all here. It's all here. So please book for. And he told you that it's already in America now. If you want hard copy like this, and if you want uh, Kindu, go to our our store. Uh, go out to our stores. Mercy mandate. Mercy mandate. Yes, go and sir. get it there. Yes, sir. By the grace of God. So, evangelists. Like I said at the beginning of the program, please, for the hard copy book now, it's already in America. You can call this number to get your copy there. Plus one, nine one seven six two three zero seven zero four. Plus one, nine one seven six two three zero seven zero four. We'll be back tonight again, 12 midnight Nigerian time, God's willing, by the mercies of the law. But before then, I know you already have your testimonies. I want to thank all our crew. God bless you. Thank you, people of God, being there, and our Father's more auctions upon them in Jesus' name. Amen. Till you come your way tonight, 12 midnight, don't forget, Anyo, who are here is my name. God bless you. God bless the country you are connected from, and God bless Nigeria. Shalom.